cool. I know for a fact Jack's gonna absolutely hate them. Guys, do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? Hey guys, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and another haul. And I have got an Arquette haul for you guys today. I don't think it says Arquette on it. Um, so I have actually just got a parcel yesterday and I refrained from opening it because I thought it would be fun to open together. But I've actually got a couple of pieces that I got last month that I haven't had a chance to show you. So I thought I'd show you those first. I really didn't know what to pick last month because I feel like it was um, that in-between time when I'm like, is it summer, is it autumn? And like now it's raining and I feel like even this next box that I open is going to be confused. Anyway, so I picked some quite simple wardrobe staples. So I got this vest top, which is kind of like a... Um, I don't know if you call it a racer vest or just like a high neck, but it was just really nice and it's meant to be cream But I would say it's like more of like a pistachio green or like a pale yellow But it's really nice and it would look really nice with a cardigan like this um, Just like the different tones of neutrals all together Then I also got this cardigan which I think is called a cocoon cardigan um, And it's like this material, I think it's called ladder material And it's, I think it's crochet Um so it's really cute, it's just like a, a throw on piece which kind of works for all seasons so I don't think it would be very warm but yeah I haven't actually worn this yet so I need to style it up for this video and I think it will give me some inspiration on how I'm going to style it but it's definitely a wardrobe staple and one of those things that's just never going to go out of style. So now let's get on to the main event. Okay so I definitely picked random things I've just remembered. I picked two jumpers, some shorts and some sandals so these sandals i have been wanting for ages and i was thinking i don't need them because basically i these are really great dupes for the chanel um like dad sandals but i've kind of got a pair that are similar from chanel um that you guys will probably remember they're like got chains on them but they're like more of a kind of relaxed dad maybe like they're not as chunky, they're not as like in your face because obviously they're so expensive I didn't want to get a pair that were like outrageous, they're more of like a wearable dad trainer sandal and then I saw these on um, Arquette and was like these are like the perfect, they're kind of like a dupe for the Chanel ones because obviously the Chanel ones are the originals but I mean they are just really nice, they've got mock croc which I think is gorge and they i think they're gonna make my feet look really small because they're so chunky and also i know that like obviously we're going into the transitional season but i actually still love wearing chunky sandals if for quite some time when it's still when it gets cold um i just think they look really nice with like joggers or with jeans and then like a chunky knit and um, just like a cozy like with just a bit of skin on your feet showing um i'm just gonna try it on now obviously i'll show you guys a cut away oh yeah they fit perfect they're a bit big like around my oh look can you see <laughs> you can't see but i think they look really cool i know for a fact jack's gonna absolutely hate them but who cares what he thinks okay so the next summary thing i got is some men's boxes okay <laughs> don't think i'm crazy i saw someone else say they got some men's boxes and was like that is such a good idea so I just was like, do you know what? I think they're gonna look really cute as shorts. And if not, then Jack can just have them as boxes and we'll be done with it. But I think I'm right, guys. I think they're gonna be really cute shorts. They're like blue gingham, so very like men's boxes vibes. And if not, I'll wear them as pajama bottoms. Like honestly, I don't care. Um, they're a bit small, actually. Maybe I should have got like a large or a medium. This is a small man. Um, but yes. Yeah. How cute, I actually think they look really nice with this chunky knit, like a kind of jumper and shorts, and then those sandals, like guys, do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? I'm the worst singer ever. Um, so yeah, what do you think? They've got loads of boxes, um, but I just thought these were like quite a good pair to try. And also they're cheap, because they're boxes. Okay, then I have a couple of jumpers to show you. And if there's one thing that I think Arquette excel at, it is knitwear and blazers. You guys know I have a couple of blazers from them that I adore. I nearly got another blazer um, this time, but I was like, do you know what? No, it's too early. And I got this, I don't know if it's called Pointel. It's um, high neck, but like a really pretty kind of um, scallop edged high neck 
oh it's got little shoulder pads i didn't realize and then it's just like i mean it looks like do you know what that remind, sleeve reminds me of you know when you used to get those flannels from the disney shop when you were younger or from any shop that were like sprinkled up and you used to put them in the sink and they used to unravel and then there'd be like fl fl flounder is his name flounder from ariel from the um little princess little mermaid <laughs> I'm the worst. Um, that's what it reminds me of. Anyway, I just thought it was really nice wardrobe staple, great for transitioning. I think it will look really nice actually with some jeans and those chunky sandals. Like I'm seeing it in my head, and yeah, it's going to look good. Um, and just, I just think it will look good with a lot of things. You're going to see it on, and you're going to agree. Then finally, I've got something that I do not have many of, which you'll be shocked at because I'm always like. Say I don't have anything of any any of anything, and I have it some of everything, but it is a black jumper, and you can't really see because of the fact that it's black. But it's got a weird like V asymmetric neckline. So again, it's similar to the other one where it's like a skinny jumper. But I just think it'll look really nice chucked into jeans, maybe a Gucci belt, maybe not like a simple outfit, and then this, which I just think is so nice. It's really soft too, it's ribbed. I actually expected it to be a thicker material, um, but I'm quite pleased that it's not, because I think I'll wear it definitely like right away. Um, but I just think it's a really cool, really cool top, and I just love, love, love filling my wardrobe with like really simple pieces. I like wardrobe staples with a twist. So yeah, it's a simple black jumper, but it's just got that cool detailing that makes it a bit different. Because um, I do tend to stick to neutrals in winter, but we'll see because I'm kind of having a love affair with pastel at the moment. So that is everything that I wanted to show you guys. I feel like I've literally blasted through that. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this haul. Uh, let me know what you think about Arquette. Have you shopped there before? Did you know about it before? I'm really sorry if you're not in the UK. Well, there are other places that you can shop it if you're not in the UK. But if you're in the US, I'm really sorry because I know that you guys can't get it. Um, but that doesn't mean, I mean I still like it and want to share it, so sorry. Um, maybe I'll try and find some US alternatives for you guys. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up because it means a lot. And also, like, it's a great way of me knowing which videos you guys actually do like. Um, if you got to the end, then leave me a little an emoji of some men's boxes. <laughs> and let me know which is your favorite piece and i will see you guys next time bye